Your constitution is the guide on how to run the association. It sets out the role of your committee, your purpose for being incorporated, how to become a member, and how to deal with conflict. You can write your own constitution or you can choose to use the model constitution. The model constitution is located on the NT Government Associations Compliance Team website. This document has been written to satisfy the requirements of the legislation and to make it easier for you to identify how you would like to operate. Your association is able to write your own constitution to suit your needs. Please be mindful that there are legislated requirements for your constitution. The NT Government Associations Compliance Team is available to review your draft constitution to confirm the requirements have been met. Once finalised, it should be lodged formally with the Territory Business Centre. Section 21 of the Associations Act 2003 identifies the minimum details required. Who can be a member and how to apply? The election of the committee and their powers. How to handle conflict. How to manage your funds. Rules for altering your constitution. The legal name of the association must include the word incorporated. The minimum notice to your members for your annual general meeting must be at least 14 days. The amount of notice for a special resolution is at least 21 days. Your association can also make its own bylaws. Bylaws usually include a code of conduct, policies and day-to-day -day operational procedures. Your bylaws are separate to the Constitution and do not need to be submitted to the NT Government Association's Compliance Team for approval. Your bylaws may be amended at any time to suit the needs of the Association. However, any changes must be approved by the membership at a general meeting and must not contradict your Constitution. Your constitution should advise if employees are considered members of the association and what their rights are. Some employees are permitted on the committee, however, are not able to vote to ensure there is no conflict of interest. To make any changes to the constitution, the current version must be amended or replaced. The new constitution must be presented to members at a special resolution, at an annual general meeting or a special general meeting. If members approve the changes, then your association is ready to lodge the new document. The new constitution is not able to be used until it has been lodged and assessed as compliant with the legislation by the NT Government Association's compliance team. Your new constitution can be lodged with the Territory Business Centre or by using the online portal you will need to provide the Constitution, AGM or SGM minutes, an application form, and the fee when you lodge. The Association will be notified once the document is accepted and recorded on the Public Register. To avoid late fees, the Constitution should be lodged within 28 days of the meeting they were presented at. For more information on starting an Association and becoming incorporated, please keep watching or chat to the Association's Compliance Team at associations.compliance at nt.gov.au. Visit www.nt.gov.au forward slash associations.